I don't know why my legs suddenly get like 50% shorter. This one is just ridiculous. Oh, this one is too much. Hey guys, what's up? It's been a while since we last did a video together. I was gone, and now I'm back. We did the style swap challenge together. Mm -hmm. We both have obviously very different styles. How would you describe your style? Me? Um, I'd say like casual black. Black. <laughs> I'd say my style is... Pink. Pretty colorful. I like to dress in various styles and try out different combinations and wear lots of different colors depending on my mood. So I think instead of following trends, I kind of create my own style based on stuff that I really like. I also dress depending on my mood. Like when I'm sad, I wear black. And when I'm happy, I also wear black. We each chose four outfits from each other's closet. My closet is a mess at the moment. We're in the middle of reorganizing our house, so I'm working on it. My clothes are spread all over the place. So I tried to pick out some stuff, but it was hard. Like, you have way too much stuff. Yeah, you really need to marry condo the whole place. I will. You can't tell me that all the stuff sparks joy. It doesn't. It doesn't. No. So in the end, I helped Dongin to pick out my outfits because it was nearly impossible to find outfits that I actually wear. Your closet on the other hand is very minimalistic. Yeah, minimalistic. I don't like to have lots of stuff. Now let's have an exclusive look into Dwayne's closet. Yeah, look, this, all this is Farina's and this little tiny space, this is mine. It's gonna be pretty hard to pick four different outfits because there's not too much variety in terms of color. That's not true. Oh, that's true. Maybe it's like some gray in here, <laughs> some blue, some white, yeah. And then I found your Airism collection. Airism? Airism? Airism stock? Yeah, I love those. Airism, yeah. <laughs> I'm wearing one right now. This is an Airism. Yeah. It's like wearing air clouds. Yeah, they were on sale for like five dollars each and mm -hmm. just grabbed like ten of them. I remember. <laughs> you can tell at the moment we kind of have the same hair length. So we thought for this video we might as well swap our hairstyles for mm -hmm. a full transformation. I wear my hair straightened most of the time. You like to wear your hair wavy and wild. Yeah, last year. Was it last year? No. Like two years ago, right? Yeah, two years, two years ago. ago I discovered the magic of perms. Perms. First I tried to give Tungin my mushroom style. Mushroom, yeah. I tried to give him a little blowout with a round brush as I wasn't allowed to use the hair straightener for your hair, was, right? I'm very worried about my hair. Like My hairdresser told me heat kills the curls. You guys have been asking a lot about our hair care routines lately and I've reached out to the brand that I've been using for a while now and luckily they agreed to sponsor us. So huge thanks to Function of Beauty for sponsoring this video. They provide custom hair products according to your goals and needs. I've been using this brand for while now but Tween also tried it out lately. My first fancy hair product. This is by far the best quality stuff I've ever used. Mm, yeah it's really good. My hair is way too healthy now and it grows like like crazy. I can't stop it from growing. <laughs> Obviously my hair isn't pink by nature so I keep forgetting. Before dyeing it pink I have to bleach it. I use my silver shampoo. It's also called purple shampoo and it prevents the bleached hair from turning yellow. You can customize your products and choose five hair goals. I chose reducing resiness, deep conditioning, thermal protection, anti-frizz and shine. Ever since I use it my hair looks and feels a lot more smooth and healthy. I chose curl definition. Other things you can customize are fragrance, color and your name on the bottles. Doesn't have to be your name, it can be any name. True. For this time's function of Farina, I chose Cherry Blossom, which is my fave scent so far. They actually sent me this leave-in treatment as an extra, as well as this serum. I use it like after every wash as like curl definition. The products are 100% cruelty-free and vegan, so I definitely recommend you to just try it out for yourself. Every hair is unique and so are your hair goals. So I think it's great to target your specific hair concerns with a formula that's put together just for you. When you click the link below in the description box, you'll get 20 20% off your first set. Outfit number one. First outfit was this pair of very comfy pants, mm -hmm. right? Oh, look at me. <laughs> These are cool. Now I actually really like that it's like high waist. It's, it's comfy, right? Yeah, it makes your legs look way longer. I know. Yeah, I now know the secret. <laughs> I think I wore like similar stuff as a team when I did the wushu. It feels like something, you know, martial artists would wear. <laughs> it's what I imagine the pants they wear in those kung fu movies where mm -hmm. they all flying around feel like. I was really surprised how well it fit you. Yeah, but then, then there's this. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> why, do I, why do I feel like some Dragon Ball characters? 
when they do like fusion, they suddenly have this weird little vest on. It's kind of similar. I think this was an obvious Jojo look. <laughs> <laughs> it does look like Jojo. Like one of those villains. The puffy sleeves, it's definitely a look. Yeah, it makes my shoulders look like broader, right? Yeah. Makes me look strong. Why does it fit you? <laughs> I don't get it. Okay. Okay. You dig it? Look like I'm cross-dressing, but <laughs> it's liberating. I'm gonna add my pastel moon earrings, of course. Yeah, I actually like, usually I only wear silver stuff, mm -hmm. but I dig the gold. Yeah? I dig the gold, yeah. I feel like I have to talk like extra manly now. I look beautiful! <laughs> hey guys, is that? <laughs> <laughs> I was actually feeling myself in this outfit though. Oh, I could the tell. Moment, the moment you said Jojo, I was sold. <laughs> no, you look gorgeous. Thank you. Very, very pretty. My first outfit was a simple white Pokemon t-shirt paired with a pair of blue jeans. I think you look pretty normal though. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's so how come you look normal when I look like this? <laughs> how do you wear this, this shirt? You wear it like this or do you do a French tuck? No, I just wear it like... A shirt. <laughs> well, I remember I bought the shirt for you in Seoul in a mall the day before our departure. I see, I see Pokemon stuff. I love Pokemon. <laughs> I, love, I see Pokemon stuff. I want it. You actually wanted the black one, of course, but I thought some color would be nice, so I gave you this one as a gift. Mm -hmm. I was very happy about it. But this is one of the shirts that look really cool in the store. When you actually wear it, you look like you're 12. <laughs> You don't! Well, I definitely wear this shirt myself because it's pretty cute and fun. I wore it when I met Eric Nam. Oh, you did? Yeah. I wonder how he liked it. I bet he was like, what's this grade schooler doing here? <laughs> I don't know why my legs suddenly get like 50% shorter with these shoes. Oh, they do look pretty short. <laughs> I don't know why. Why is it? Because you always wear high waist. Yeah. Maybe they were short all along. Top. Like That's cheating. I can't look any better than this. <laughs> I'm not a fan of these pants though on me. I prefer high-waisted pants, but all in all, it's a pretty nice look, right? It's, yeah. it's pretty nice. I like it. It's nice. <laughs> well, your second outfit was a bit tighter. You want me to wear a body? I do. Go, try it on. <laughs> Definitely was, yeah. <laughs> Luckily my clothes are mostly stretchy. I think it made some ripping sounds though. It, it did. Yeah, definitely it did. Yeah. <laughs> I couldn't I couldn't like close it. And also the bulging, the bulging situation, yeah, but that, that was definitely an issue. I didn't really feel safe. Mm -hmm. me, me neither. <laughs> it looks so weird. <laughs> Chest area is a bit a bit tight. <laughs> <laughs> it's a look. It's a look. You yeah. can't deny. Yeah, it's it's a young look. Hmm. It's very 2010 girly. It's really embracing your soft side, I think. Yeah, very wild. It is wild. I I definitely enjoyed your cleavage in this. Yeah, kind of trashy though. Kind of trashy. I do look kind of trashy. <laughs> Kind of trashy. Yeah. Okay, my second outfit was your camo pants paired with a kimono and your infamous airism. It's like you're wearing nothing. <laughs> Let's see. Oh. Oh. Can you feel it? Oh. Can you feel the I airism? I can. <laughs> so do you do you tuck this in? No. No. I never tuck anything in. No. No. It's like bed. Yeah. The outfit was pretty baggy compared to what I usually wear. For me, it's not baggy. <laughs> no, for you it's not, but it's, it's a bit too big for me. Usually when I wear baggy pants, I wear a tight top and the other way around. But it was really comfy and actually lightweight. And I really like the cap. It looks really good with the ponytail. It looks cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it definitely has a teenage boy vibe. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think mainly because it's not your size, right? Yeah, probably. Because it's not supposed to be baggy. It's supposed to be actually a pretty Tight. Muscle enhancing. Yeah, it only works if you have to, like some pack action going on. Yeah. Third outfit was my fave. Oh yeah. Like you, you rock this look. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> like, those pants, they do look like some weird karate pants also. I don't know why. It was like some street fight <laughs> outfit. Yeah, I would actually wear those, but not in the way you told me to. Somehow I noticed that all my pants are high waist. Yeah, but, right? <laughs> but it doesn't work if you have like extra baggage down there. That's kind of dangerous right <laughs> it is indeed should walk around like that can, can, can you 
maybe like adjust it? Let's try. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, it's worse. <laughs> Crop top. Crop top. <laughs> wow. And your help. Very small. Mm. Extremely tight. But stretchy. Yeah, I, I, I needed help putting it on. Mm -hmm. But I liked the way, I actually liked the way it emphasizes like my, my upper body, oh. right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I call it the lemon pants. Lemon pants. Yeah. When you wore it, there were lemons everywhere. <laughs> And the teddy bear jacket was the final touch. I love the teddy bear jacket. Like, I'm stealing this teddy bear jacket. It's mine now. Really? Yeah. It does look pretty, like, bogey, right? Yeah. And topped off with a scrunchy bun. Uh, the hair. The hair ruined it. The hair ruined the outfit. No. No, it, it made it a less serious look. <laughs> Made it less, less kind of, yeah, yeah. Like with proper hair, with a proper hairstyle and everything, this could have been like a legit background Magazine dancer. Cover. No, okay, <laughs> I, I was thinking background dancer, like background dancer outfit. Imagine like ten guys wearing this. Yeah, yeah JoJo. Dancing in the back. <laughs> I don't know why, maybe it's like the liter of coffee I had after lunch, but I really started feeling this outfit for some reason. Yeah, your posing game was on point. I guess it's like the ad adrenaline, right? And you kept telling me how, how amazing I look, so... Oh yeah. Yeah, I, start, I really started feeling it. My third outfit was... My favorite outfit. Right, you wear it all the time, I'm as you can it see. Right now. Paired with these pants, your only real pants. Yeah, I can't like describe these pants. I want more of these. China is, it, is it a chino? This time it's an airism tank top oh, and yeah. you did not lie, it's very comfy. Okay, so like... Yeah, like I always wear it like oh. very open and windy, you know? The wind blows, it just flows like a cape, yeah. We get a lot of comments like telling me, oh, you wear this every day. Why can't we wear stuff multiple times and multiple occasions? That's like, true. Like, have you seen my closet? Where do you expect me to get new outfits from? <laughs> I feel so dreamy in this. Feels good, right? Yeah. Like, hey, baby girl. Yeah, can you stop with the, with the sex voice? <laughs> baby girl. I suddenly felt very seductive. Just comfy. <laughs> <laughs> like kind of boyfriend material. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Isn't that so? Uh huh. Well, I definitely felt seduced. I think it's the open shirt and cleavage combo. It makes oh. you feel like a Casanova. <laughs> Casanova. Yeah. I have like heat issues. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I, get, I get very hot. <laughs> so I'm not trying to seduce anyone. I'm, I just get very, I just get very warm. Oh, but I was. Now, this is my favorite outfit. Actually bringing in some color. I think it was the first non-black shirt we ever bought together for you. Yeah, I never, I never wear it nowadays. I used to wear it all the time back then. I could wear this. Yeah. Can I keep it? Yeah, sure. Please? Yeah, but I get to keep this. Not with the lemon down here. You should wear pink more often. The pants are incredibly comfy. I think I don't even own a pair that comfortable. It would be nice if you could give me this outfit, maybe? You can keep the shirt, but those pants aren't going anywhere. So, um, black, pink, black, pink. Oh, yeah. So with the cap and all, this outfit kind of reminds me of the chill outfits Koreans wear when they aren't dressing up. Add a pair of slippers and off to the convenience store. Oh, I, I wear this stuff with my burks and go to work. <laughs> True. So yeah, this one was definitely my winner. Okay, so last outfit was this. I think at this point, we're just making fun of me. At this point? Yeah. <laughs> I really like this on you. I think the off-shoulder top really emphasized your neck area. I was actually looking forward to wearing the leggings. Do I look pretty from the back? Because mm -hmm. it really emphasizes like the glutes and the thighs and everything. It does. And Absolutely. I said, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I see a lot of guys wearing leggings. Yeah, the workout leggings. I don't know what they're right. called. Man leggings. Yeah. I don't so, know. <laughs> can't take this seriously. <laughs> You know, like the other one, kind of like, felt like I could pull it off. Okay. I could still pull it off, but this one is like, this one is just ridiculous. Oh, this one is too much? This one is too much. I didn't think they would like flare out like this. This is the point where it all just got ridiculous. <laughs> 
this is the point. Yeah, with the pants, you kind of looked like John Travolta in Night Fever, but it really made your thighs pop. Yeah, like, sure did. It did. Okay, guys, so that's it for today. I think this was a really nice experience. It was an experience. So who do you think pulled it off better? I'll have to admit, I would wear most of this stuff on a daily basis. No? No, but, but you, you actually, you could pull it off. It looked pretty good for the most part. Well, I think you looked stunning in each outfit. Okay guys, so if you like this video and would like to see more of this kind of videos, do tell me in the comments. We got a lot more outfits for you. Well. At least I do. Yeah. I hope you guys liked this video. Leave a like if you did. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos. I see you in the next one. Bye.